What's up, weirdos? We're back in subsistence for episode 7, and today we're going to have to get cured. We are, uh, we're a little sick. We got infected. We ate some, uh, some raw chicken by accident. And, uh, yeah, we gotta deal with that, so, uh, it kinda sucks. Uh, but the good news is we do already have three tonics here. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and grab those. And we have three kelp, so we just need two more, and then we just have to find a liver. Uh, now, I do want to get some more ammo, because right now we just have, uh, four shotgun shells, so I want to make a couple more of these if I can. Um, let's see, yeah, let's do one more. That'll be good. So that'll give us eight. I'm gonna throw this stuff back in here, and I got the iron right here. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on a refiner, because I want to get a lockpick, if we can. So go ahead and get that going. You can see it will drain some power. But that is okay, because uh, we, we do have some power and mass. We don't really have to worry about anything turning off if, if this drains it all the way down to zero. It doesn't really matter for us. Um, we'll go ahead and check this, make sure we got this topped off. Might as well do that. I know there's a bear around us. I'm pretty sure it's a bear. We're going to have to get some water, too. Yeah, there's that bear over there. Uh, oh, did I? Oh, I just used a bandage by accident, guys. I always do that. Okay, two. The gun is in two. It's not one. It's two. All right. What do we got down there? We got a wolf. All right. We might be able to get ourselves a liver right off the bat. I'm hoping, hoping we can do it. I just got to get a good, clear view of him. Yeah, that's not going to work. I don't want to get too close to that bear. We got that bear. Just to he's just so close. All right. Oh, missed the first shot. Got him. Alright. Reload before I forget. Okay, and let's go down to the axe and butcher. Please give me a liver. There we go. Nice. We got two. Alright, so that's a good start right there. Now, where's that bear at? He's over there. Man, he's going to be... He's going to be right by our base, isn't he? That sucks. Alright, so I need to wash my hands off. Uh, is it going to give me the odd option? Oh, come on. There we go. Alright, we, we had to get a little bit further into the water. Alright, so we are a little bit cold, which kind of sucks. I think if we go down to uh, a lower elevation, we'll be okay. There is a bear here, though. Oh, man. Oh, man. Alright, we're going to have to hoof it. Run! Scrap metal, that's something we really need. I was looking uh, this morning, and we are out of scrap metal completely. I had to make one more uh, one more canteen. We are completely out of scrap metal now, so that uh, that's going to be the one thing this season that we are going to have a hard time finding. It's usually every season there's one thing that uh, you have a shortage of. This season, it certainly appears like it's going to be a scrap metal. Another thing we have to do is keep an eye out for hunters, because I know we have one hunter base up there. But, they can come in at all different places, so we got to watch out for them. And there can also be rogues. Now, I'm going to go here and fill up my canteens, because that's got to get done. We are getting kind of thirsty, I think. So, let's go ahead and fill. Fill. Uh, we'll go ahead and eat a bunny. There we go. And, uh, might as well... Top it off. Eat a chicken as well. There we go. Very good. Alright. And I need to dive for some kelp. So I'm trying to think of where the best place to do that is. Over here, it's kind of deep. Not the best place. we got a crate right here. I'm going to go ahead and grab what's in here. Hopefully something good. Uh, yeah, very good. That's a, that's a good crate right there. Usually ammo crates aren't that good, but that was a nice one. Alright, we've got another crate down there. We've got a wolf up there. Okay. And get the gun out just in case. We got the ammo, so might as well use it if we have to. Now he's going to leave us alone. Alright, so there we go. And grab that. Got a protein bar. That could come in very handy. We might need that. Alright, and let's head up this way. I want to hit up this tree. If possible, I think we're okay. Let's get the axe out. 
Got a wolf over there. I think he's a level three. Yeah, we don't really want to mess with him. Alright, and let's go down this way. Uh, please no hunters. Please no hunters. I see a bunny over there. And, oh, some crates. Very good. Let's grab that, and let's see what this one is. This is this a... Oh, this is a lock crate. Alright, so we may not be able to get this one. Because we don't have a lockpick. We do have some iron being made right now back at the base, but I, I don't think we're going to have that by the end of the day. Let's see if we can get this rabbit. Oh ho ho! There we go! And let's take a little dive in here for some kelp. Let's make sure there's no animals around first. That's a bad idea to <laughs> just jump right in. Just in case. Alright, I see one kelp over there. We just need two. I see a couple down here. Is there any hunters on the other side of the water? No. Alright, so I think I think right now there's just one hunter camp. It usually takes them a few days before the rest come in. I see three, uh, three kelp right down here, so let's go ahead and grab those. Take a breath and go down. There's one, two, three. Let's come back up. I see something right there. Is that a, uh, I think that's sandstone right there. Let's get the pickaxe out just for a second. And before I do that, we have everything we need, so let's go ahead and make this. Craft that up. Okay. Back down here. We'll hit this up. We're going to need this to make glass. There we go. And let's look for some more kelp, because I am going to need my fruits and vegetables. I think I saw a couple down this way. Yeah, maybe I didn't. Is there anything? There's one over here. Okay, that's fine. One is better than none. Go ahead and grab that. And we will head back up towards our base. Let's see if there's any crates along the way. Again, I'd love to get this lock crate. I don't think we're going to have everything we need for it, though. Because I think we also need scrap to make that lock pick. we got a level 2 bear right in front of us. And I really don't want to mess with him. You got that wolf over there. Now we're going to have to go in between them. Yep, there's a rabbit. He's going to run right to that bear. So, we're not going to be able to get him. We'll keep moving. Oh, what's that? There's another one. Sneaky, sneaky. Got it. Got him. Oh, ho, ho. So there we go. There's two rabbits for us. We also have a liver, so I think we'll be eating like kings tonight. Go ahead and get this crate. There we go. Some more nails. We're doing pretty good on nails. And a, a blueberry there. That helps a lot. I'm going to need that. Here's some more scrap. Okay, good. So, so far, pretty good day to start uh, w with the, the scrap right there. we got five scrap right there. That's looking pretty good. I need to go ahead and use this before I forget. And we're no longer infected, which is awesome. And we're going to go ahead and eat these. And now we're feeling a lot better. We're going to bring our meat down here. Okay. Grab some fibers. And I'd like to get some base building done today. I don't know if that's going to happen, though. We do have uh, fibers and cordage, so that's not a problem. And we also have wood. I think we have a decent amount of nails, too. There's some scrap right there. Really don't want to mess with that bear. Here's some scrap. Okay, good. Good. Is there any more? Sometimes you got to look around. I'm going to risk it, guys. We really need this. Grab that. There we go. Uh-oh. We got a wolf on us. I didn't even see him. I didn't even hear him. There's a bear right there. 
Alright, move this way. He's really on us right now. Just don't bite me. I do not want to get infected again. He's still on us, guys. I think he gave up. Yep, he gave up. Alright, so we'll go ahead and hit up a few trees, try to get our stamina back up. Oh, that could have been really scary. Let's take a look at how we're doing. Uh, I think we should probably head back. We need to cook this water, get it boiled. It is, we are getting into the hotter part of the year. And the last thing we want to do is uh, not have any potable water on us. Because that's another way you can get infected. Hello, chicken. Gonna take you home with me. Pluck your feathers off and then eat you. You're not gonna like that, but I will. Alright, I know there was a bear over here. I know there's a bear up by our base. I just hope he moved. I'm just trying to think of the best way to pull him away from it. Maybe this is the bear that was by our base. I'm hoping. I see some more scrap. And a crate. So, that is pretty nice to see. I, I'm really happy, man. That, uh, starting the day and seeing that it didn't have any scrap left was a, a little bit scary. Alright, there's a bear. If we can get this. He's gonna go ahead and take a swim right there. Okay, good. Get himself a nice little drink. We're gonna go this way. Go around. And yep, he's gonna just leave us alone. Okay, very good. Now let's go ahead and cook some food. Pop up here. See how this is doing. We have, oh wow, 13 iron fragments. Okay, well that's pretty good. It is draining the power though. So I might need to turn that off a little bit. Toss this stuff in there. We'll throw some wood in. Okay, and we'll go ahead and cook this up. Protein bars, we can toss them in here. We're going to we're gonna store those up. I'm going to go ahead and toss these blueberries in here too. Uh, we're going to put away the guns. I don't really need those on me right now. Okay, uh, let's see. We can go ahead and render the fat. Okay... Toss this stuff in here. We're up to 129 nails. That's a good sign. Uh, let's see. Seven arrows. That's good for now. I can make some more later. Okay. And let's see. Toss this stuff in there. We can make one more shotgun shell if we really want to. I'm going to hold off on that. Throw our ammo in there. That's fine. And, um, yeah, we'll just toss that in there. This is full. Wow. That's amazing. Alright, this is done. I'm going to go ahead and take a drink. Might need to take two drinks. Um, yeah, we're good for now. Alright, and we can go ahead and toss these guys in here too. Toss the fabric in there. That's good. We, need, we needed the cloth. And this is done. We'll go ahead and have a little snack. Keep the chicken on us until he dies. Okay, and let's see. We're going to need clothes at some point. Uh, right now we have the lightweight shirt and the lightweight pants. And uh, they're definitely affected by the heat. That is one thing you got to keep in mind. We are going to have to make some heavier, heavy-duty clothes, though. Uh, and we're not going to have a whole lot of time. So that's going to be a big challenge for us is getting prepared for the winter time because it is literally right around the corner. I know it's April, but it's only 48 days. For the calendar season, so that's going to be a challenge for us. And it's going to be tough finding enough <laughs> enough cloth for this. All right, there's our food, all done. All right, we'll keep the chicken on us, I guess. And we'll toss this stuff in here. I don't really need to eat right now, so let's go back out and do some more looting. That bear's going to just hang out over there, so that is fine. I'm going to go this way. Grab this fiber right here. We'll go ahead and get some more wood. Because, like I said, I would like to do some more building. 
I don't know how much we're going to get done, but uh, it, it would be nice. Be nice to close off our base just in case we do get attacked by hunters. Just in case I accidentally step into their camp and they get mad and start shooting at us. Because then they will come after us. And we don't want that to happen. Definitely don't want that happening. So I think I want to go up in this direction. The only thing we have to do is watch out for the mountain lions. Because they do like to spawn up this area. So just got to be a little careful. Is that a crate over there? I think that's just a fern. Get a good look up here. Alright, I'm not seeing anything. No crates, no mountain lines, anything like that. I think we should probably go back and uh, see if we can get that refiner going again. We probably have enough power now to finish. Get a little bit more wood. All right. Yeah, just stay over there, bear. Don't come near my base. I really don't want to mess with you. Those bears, they take a few shotgun shots, and you got to make sure you don't miss, because if you miss, you're in big trouble. Okay, he, he doesn't see us, so that's a good sign. Alright, let's turn this back on. We have 93 power. I think that'll be enough. We just need five more. What do we need for a lockpick? I think we need a couple scrap. Yeah, we need, oh, we need four scrap, two planks, and 18 iron fragments. I don't think we're going to have enough power. I think that's going to be an issue. Uh, we do have this. Maybe we go ahead and turn this on. Let that run. Okay. Now the planks. Do we have planks ready to go? I don't think we... Oh, we got two. Perfect. Alright. So when I come back, we should be able to get that going. And the chicken is now dead, so we'll go ahead and butcher. Toss it in there. Grab this fat. Grab all that. That can all go in here. There we go. Alright. The bear's over there. I'm going to try to get some more water, if it'll let me. Uh, yeah, don't come this way, please. Please don't come this way. Uh, go ahead and fill. He's just going to stay on that island. Hey, I'm fine if he stays over there. It's just when he comes over this way... And you, and you have to worry about him breaking your base. That's not so fun. I don't like that. Alright, there we go. So we got a rabbit and some chickens. I'm, I don't know if I'm hungry enough to eat that rabbit. Eh, I, I think we are. Let's go ahead and eat that. We'll just let that boil down. Toss this stuff in here. We need to get a garden going, too. Because we're not going to have a whole lot of time to grow vegetables. Alright. That is clean and ready to drink. I'm going to hold off on drinking just for a little bit. Now, we could come down here and see how our hunter friends are doing. Let's go ahead and get out a gun. I do not want to get killed. Got a wolf over there. Now, I don't see that other bear. Is he down this way? I'm not seeing him down here. I always need to pick out an escape route, just in case. Just in case uh, I run into some trouble. I need to know which way I can flee. You should always keep that in mind, no matter where you go in this game. Even if you're just going out to loot. Because this game is relentless. It is not an easy game, especially for beginners. Got a little bit of, uh, looks like iron right here. So I'm going to go ahead and hit this up. There's that bear. Alright, i uh, got to go ahead and crouch. Alright. 
Right, let's come over here. All right, got another bear there. And looks like a fern. Oh man, I thought that was scrap. Got another chicken here. Do we need the chicken? There's two of them here. You know what? I'm going to kill him anyway because at least we get some feathers. At, at the very least, we'll get some feathers. Okay. Where's that other one at? Got a wolf over there. Alright. This may not be a good idea coming over this way. I'd like to explore that more, but I don't think it's going to happen. That's a level 3 wolf. I really don't want to get in a fight with a wolf right now. get the axe out. We're going to go ahead and hit up this tree. More wood, and maybe make some planks. It's probably a good idea. We're going to need them. I do want to make some walls. So let's go in here, and we got six, so that's that'll give us a couple planks. That's a start. Oh, look at that crate. I didn't even see that. Did that just spawn in? Alright, here we go. Another shotgun shell. That's really nice to see. Let's come back down this way. Uh, yeah, shotgun. Just in case. There's there's two bears down here. we got one off to our right and one off to our left. We're going to thread the needle. Right in between the bears. Don't want to upset them. Alright, there's some fiber up here. I'm going to grab it. And, oh, another crate. That's more important. Another chicken over there, but I think we're good on food. I don't think we need any more. Alright, one. I see another one down here. Two. Three. And another crate right over there. So let's look out for wolves and bears and whatever else might attack us. You never know. I hear a chicken and a rabbit up there. Boy, that rabbit might be useful. I know I don't need really need to kill anymore, but oh, there's a bear. Look at that. All right, let's come up here and take a look. I think that rabbit ran away. I don't see him. Okay. Now we could start heading back. We gotta go around this bear though. First things first, we should check and see. Oh, okay. We got some friends over here. I was gonna say, let's check and see if that um, lock crate is still there, but I don't know if we're gonna be able to do that. Uh, hello there, bear. Yeah, he sees us. So we're gonna go up here. Hopefully, nothing up here that can attack us. I'm going to go ahead and hit these up. Looks like some more iron. Alright. Good. Good. That bear's down there, so we don't have to worry about him. A little bit of copper right here. Very nice. Alright. All right, there's the bear again, back on the shoreline. He's walking towards our, no, oh, he's walking towards our base. Man, you're just gonna be a problem, aren't you? I really don't wanna kill him. Well, I might have to, guys. Oh, look at that, we got a crate right next to our base. Look at that, guys. Can I get this without the bear seeing me? Oh, man, guys. Oh, man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You don't see me. You don't see me, bear. He doesn't see me. You don't see me. Seriously, do not come over here. Can I get up here? Oh, you don't see me. I'm not over here. 
Okay, we're good. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. We got our iron. And we've got enough power and mass. So let's give this a go. We need four of these. So there we go, just four. Okay, and we have our planks. So let's go ahead and make this craft. There we go. We're going to lose all of our power and mass that we built up, unfortunately. But uh, hey, that, that happens. It happens, guys. All right, and we're going to go ahead and throw all this wonderful stuff in here. Uh, more iron. That's great to see. Going to keep the chicken on us. I'm going to go ahead and eat a rabbit here. And, uh, yeah, we're going to have to have some vegetables, too. Unfortunately, this is all we got left. A couple of blueberries. Hopefully we find some more. That is one bad thing about camping up here. You don't really, uh, you don't really get too close to the water that often. And the kelp only spawns in the ponds and the lakes. That's why it's a good idea when you're starting out. Camp by a pond. It just makes things so much easier. I'm going to have a drink right here. And let's see. Oh, you know what? I forgot the lockpick. I need to grab that. All right, there we go. I'm going to switch that and put that right there. I like to keep it there in that top corner. Okay, so we're going to go and see if that lock crate is still there. I have a feeling it's probably gone by now. But it's it's always good to check. They do they do despawn pretty quick. Like if you find one and then you leave the area, it's almost certain that it's gonna despawn. But maybe we get lucky. I thought I heard footsteps. Oh man, guys, I thought for sure we just ran into a like a rogue hunter or something like that. We well, gotta be careful because they will spawn in. And I'm thinking they're probably going to spawn on this side somewhere. Alright, now where was that crate? It was down by the water. There's that bear. Let's see if we can go around this way. I need a clear, uh, clear vision here. I don't want anything obstructing my view. Alright. I think it's down this way. Pretty sure. Some fiber right here. Alright, there's a wolf over there. I don't think there's any more wolves. I think it was just that one. Okay, there's a wolf. Oh, there's a wolf down there. And a bear right next to him. I think it was right down here that the, uh, the crate was sitting. Yeah, it's gone. I do not see it. I see a rabbit, but the crate, I believe, has vanished, unfortunately. So that sucks, but hey, we have a lockpick, so we're ready in case we find one tomorrow. So that is good. I'm going to grab some of this fiber over here because there seems to be a decent amount. We've got a deer over there. We also have a wolf that he's going to kind of leave us alone, I think. Let's crouch, see if we can get... Oh, you're kind of close there. Mr. Wolfie. I got some nails, though. All right. We're going to run down here, chase after this deer. I, I think he's... Uh, yeah, he's level 3. I'm not going to mess with him. I could try to take him down, but it's just not worth it. What's that? Is that scrap? That's scrap. It's so hard to see sometimes, especially when the sun's shining in your face. That's one thing I love about this game, is it's so realistic sometimes. And sometimes it's unrealistic, with wolves and bears uh, everywhere. <laughs> That's not very realistic. But it does make the game fun. It does make it uh, definitely a challenge. Alright, so a pretty good day. I'm going to go back up here and see if we can get some building done. Um, yeah, we're going to have to make some more boards. Alright, just, just no bears, please. No bears. Hi, chicken. Can I catch you like this? I might be able to. I'm not going to mess with it. Let's see where that bear is at. He's right here. Oh, man, guys. He's literally right here. Kind of looking at us. Yeah, that's not, that's not going to work. Okay, he's going to follow us a little bit. I might be able to pull him away from our base. I'm going to try to do that because uh, we don't really have much, much of an option here. See if I can just kind of pull them over this way. 
Hopefully there's nothing over here that can... Oh, see, there's a uh, mountain lion up there. Yep, look out for the mountain lions. They are, they are out. They are out. All right. Bear's going to hang out over there. Hopefully he doesn't come back to our base. I really don't want to shoot him, but I will if I have to. I really don't want to waste my ammo, though. That needs to be used for other things, because we don't have a whole lot of time to gather resources before uh, before winter comes. All right. So we're back. I'm going to go ahead and cook up another chicken. Go ahead and eat this one. Unfortunately, we don't have any vegetables, so that we have this one potato. That's it. So that's going to be an issue. That's definitely going to be an issue for us. Uh, but we can go ahead and make some more boards. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. There we go. See how our fire's doing. We'll go ahead and top that off too. Toss this in here. Okay. Grab this. Toss this stuff in here. Okay, lots of nails right there. I don't think I need all of those nails. We'll split that in half. Just put that there. Uh, we'll go ahead and grab some of the cordage and we'll toss all this stuff in here for now. Very good. All right. Now, what do we want to do here? I think we want to get... If I can get two walls, that'd be pretty good. Is that the moon coming out? There's the moon right there. That's pretty cool. I do like that. Alright, so I want two walls. Now, eventually, I'm going to go ahead and put some windows in this. But for now, I'm going to do uh, walls without the windows. Just so, uh, just so we protect ourselves from the hunters. That's pretty much it. I don't want to deal with the hunters right now. We will have to fight them eventually, because they do have some pretty nice stuff on them. But uh, if I can avoid them until like later in the year, that would be uh, that would be just peachy, I think. Okay, so uh, let's see. We need one more wall. We just need just need another board for that. We can make a few more boards, I think. There we go. I think we I think we'll have everything except for a door. Pretty sure. Go ahead and craft that. And then I want to make a wooden doorway. We're going to need four more boards for that. So while that stuff crafts, let's see. We have one wall being built right now. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and grab the fishing rod. I'm going to put that in here for now. So we're not using it. We'll put this in here too. Vegetables is going to be a, just a huge concern for us in the morning. But uh, unfortunately, we have dug that hole ourselves. We're probably going to have to go and uh, die for some kelp. I think that would be our best bet. Just kind of hang around the fire tonight. Uh, there we go. We've got our first wall. So I'm going to go ahead and set that right here. There we go. We're also going to need a ceiling. We'll hold off on that. I just want to get us protected on all sides. That's number one. We're also going to need to get a uh, some stairs set up as well. Okay, so we just need one more of these and then we can get that set up. So as soon as this gets to 100%, I can go ahead and craft one of these. Fortunately, we have a decent amount of nails. I'm really happy about that. And we're down to just two cordage left, so I'm going to go ahead and make some more. So we'll add that to the queue. There we go. Very good. You can also make uh, fuel bricks with the... Um, with the cordage, or not the cordage, but the fibers. You just click on this. It takes 10 fibers. So if you don't want to use wood, you can use the fuel bricks. They will fuel it up all the way, which is kind of nice. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'd, I'd much rather save the, the fibers for something else. But, uh, you know, because, you know, the cordage is so important in this game. Um, but, and it's just, it's so easy to get wood, honestly. Alrighty. Let's grab a little bit more of this stuff. All right, and we're looking pretty good. Let's go ahead and put up this other wall. There we go. And this is almost done. So we can place that, and now you will feel a lot better about our base. It, it is coming along. It's taking some time, but, uh, you know, we've uh, we've been infected twice. So you can't make, you, you can't complain too much. Now, as long as I can get out of here and back in. Is that, uh, can I get back in? Yeah, I can, I can get back in. 
That's the important thing. I just want to make sure I can still get in there. Uh, so that is good. Uh, next episode, we're definitely going to have to get a door and some stairs on here. And, uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully we don't, uh, run into any hunters. We can take, we can take a look right now at the map. Is there any other fires? Yes, there is. There's a fire right down there, right in the middle of the screen. You can kind of see it. It's kind of glowing. So that is either another hunter camp or that's a rogue camp right down there. Okay, and is there anything else over here? As long as they avoid Kelp Bay, I'm happy. Because that's kind of our place to get kelp. No hunters down there, please. No hunters down there. I know that'll probably bring rogues down there, though. Because the rogues tend to go wherever you go. They'll decide to just camp there. So if you're going to a, a certain place, like every day, the rogues will start camping there. And that sucks. But anyway, pretty good day. Uh, pretty successful day. It was it was a tough day, but we are definitely on the move with this game, and uh, we're we're hoping to uh, get everything prepared for winter. I'm probably gonna keep the base build kind of small just because of that. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, give it a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments. Share it with your friends and subscribe to get more videos. Goodbye.